What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, so, been a rough week here. <laughs> haven't exactly felt very good, so I haven't got a lot done. Um, but, uh, we're getting there, we're getting better. And, uh, made it to work today, got back from work, and there was a package waiting for me on the porch. Uh, very, very pleasant surprise. Uh, what was in said package, you may ask? Okay, I'll tell you. Uh, I opened it up and it was from my good friend Paul at Left Coast Model Car Builds. That's a cool card. Got some of his builds on there. Got uh, his daughter and her builds on there. Uh, go check out this channel. I've tagged him before, uh, but I will tag the channel again. Um, thank you, Paul, for the card. Also in that package, very pleasant surprise, he sent a coffee mug, which is amazing. Um, thank you very much. We're getting into fall up here in New England, which means hot drinks. Uh, hot, you need a coffee mug for hot drinks. Um, unless you're Lucasy, then you drink your cold coffee out of this. I don't get it. I don't get why you... Anyway, um, so thank you, Paul. It brings up a very, very good... Uh, point I wanted to talk to you guys about anyway. I just haven't had the chance to do it this week. Uh, uh, anyway, let's not let's not go there. So Paul is hosting a group build. Uh, go over to his channel. He's a, he's put up a couple of videos for it. It's uh, Left Coast Group Build Twenty Three. Um, I'm not going to spend a lot of time talking about it. Uh, I want you to go over to his channel, look for those videos, and check it out. Um, but the gist of it is. Uh, what kit did you build when you first got into the hobby that really kicked your desire to, to continue to build into gear? Um, and how could you rebuild that kit better than you did before and also uh, push yourself now? I got the perfect kit. Um, I built this kit a good number of years ago. Um... Not sure if I've shown it on a Shelf Queen video or not. Probably not, uh, because I'm kind of, I'm not really proud of it. <laughs> Back then I was. I thought it was great. Um, now, not not so much. Um, it is the AMT 71 Duster 340. Uh, this was probably my second or third kit that I built, and I, I thought to myself, man, I did a really good job. Oh boy, I did not do a really good job, uh, but... It kind of pushed me to want to do better. Um, this is one of the kits that really got me going. So, um, you know, I'll show it to you. There's no, it's boxed off. There's no extra detail added. Uh, the wheels and tires were from another kit. That is it. Um, the paint is bad. I don't even know if you can see it. I mean, it, there you go. Look at those. Holy cow. Um, I'm not sure what I sanded this thing with, but like a wire brush maybe? I can't remember, uh, but it's awful. It's straight up awful. So um, when he did his introduction for the group build, I sat back and I looked at my kits and I looked at my stash and I looked at my kits again, scratching my head the whole time. Um, and I came up with this one. Um, and I do happen to have in the stash a brand new... Uh, unopened AMT 71 Duster 340. So, uh, we're going to do this build for this group build. Uh, yes, I know group builds. I've got a lot of them going on. Um, I've got these three over here on the desk that I have to finish for um, October 8th, which are it, that's really close. I'm good to go on that. I know uh, I'll get those done because I'm all, I've got an on-call weekend here at home, which means I'm I'm stuck to the house. I can't go anywhere unless I get called for work. Um, so plenty of bench time. So I, I know I'm going to get uh, a lot of work done on these two. The, the Lamborghini, the Nova Wagon, uh, the Street Machine Nova. I'm waiting on uh, some 3D resin parts to finish that. But that's like, that's that close. That's right there. So we got those. Um, I have the... Uh, old Tom Appreciation build that I'm going to start um, probably the second week of October. Uh, maybe the first of October. I'm not sure. Probably the first of October. I'll dig into that kit. Um, and then after the first of the year, I have uh, the Mustang 60 group build 
that I'm going to jump into for that. And let's not forget, in September, the USAC group build. That's coming up. I don't even know what i got to build for that yet, but I'm not going to miss out on that group build. That's a staple for me. Uh, I will participate in every one of those builds as they roll through. So I've got plenty of time for this one. Why do you ask? Because... Why do you ask? Because this goes until March 15th, six months. Uh, so, you know, I could wait until January. No, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> that would be bad. Uh, but we'll get going on this. Um, we'll probably get going on this October 1st, too. Uh, so I'm going to use my talents that I've accumulated in the noggin. Um... Since I first started in this hobby, I'll, I want to put a really nice paint job on this, um, use some resin pieces, um, and pushing myself to do something that I don't normally do. Uh, so I, you know I build everything in a street machine style, so what's the next step up for that? Uh, that would be back halving the car. So I think that's going to be the plan. We're going to back half this car. Where am I going to get the back half? I don't know, actually. I don't know. Uh, I'm going to have to shop around and look and see who makes a good back half. Um, I could always, I could always, uh, pull out the 67 Chevelle Pro Street kit and chop the back half off that, worst case scenario, but that's what's going to happen. So back half the car, some really nice resin wheels and tires, resin engine, de really nice paint job. We're going to fully detail it, uh, because I didn't on the last one. So... There you have it. Go over to Paul's channel, uh, check out that group build. It's a really good idea, and it's going to be fun. It's, I mean, I know you guys have got older builds that you wish you could do a better job on. Heck, I've got like a hundred of them. <laughs> so, um, I urge you, go check it out and, and jump into his group build. Show him some love. Um, so that that's it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. As always, thank you to Market Hobby Nut Models. I really, really appreciate uh, his support as well as all of your support. It means a lot to me. Thank you, guys. Um, and look for uh, an update video at the end of the week because, like I say, I'm stuck here and I'm going to try and get a bunch of stuff done. Um, and, you know, we might actually get Ryan back in the shop this weekend, too. Probably not Heather. She's got a busy weekend ahead of her, but um, we'll see what we can do. So, Thank you, guys. Go check out Paul. Jump into this group build. And I'll talk to you later this week. And this weekend. I need a beer. Bye, guys.